for words, huh, Melster? I'm styling and profiling. I look good. It feel like I'm being watched. No matter. Let me go on with the review. Hi, this is the Melster. This is my review of Till Death with Megan Fox. This movie was good. This movie will put Megan Fox back on the map. I know she hasn't made anything in a while. Her acting skills are questionable. You know, I haven't really been a fan of Megan Fox either. But if she keeps making movies like this, she'll be back. She plays a cheating wife whose anniversary is about to come up with her husband. And they have a nice romantic dinner, a good night on the town. Then, you know, they go back home, go to bed. And when she wakes up in the morning, she's handcuffed to her husband. When I saw this trailer, I was intrigued. I said, I'm not really a fan of Megan Fox. But I said, let me give this a try. And I'm glad I did. Yep, she was handcuffed to him. This movie was good. And then the man she was cheating with, he was coming to the house after she was handcuffed. And the two and it was two dudes that was coming to the house after she was handcuffed. Hmm. I wonder why is the guy she was messing around with coming to the house? And why is these two dudes out of nowhere coming to the house. Hmm. You'll have to watch the movie to find out. And it's a great movie. The pace of the movie was good. The acting was good. I can't tell you, you know, how she got handcuffed to him. You'll find out when you watch the movie. And it's something about her husband after he handcuffs himself to his wife. You gotta watch the movie, find out. It was a thrilling movie. The movie is good. If you're not a Megan Fox fan, get this movie a try. She's back with this movie. You know, I thought it was uh, well done. The suspense of the movie was great because it was suspense left and right. You're going to say, damn, I didn't see that coming. This movie is good. This is a great movie to watch. It's called Till Death. Give it a try. And you know, she was, um, and her husband, the guy that she was messing around with, 
work for a hug and they saw each other in the elevator and you know they had to play dumb like they didn't know each other but the uh, movie was good that's why it's called Tear of Death you'll find out what that means when you watch the movie because the movie was good you know her acting was good the other actor in the movie was good I just thought it was you know it was well done it's a uh, great movie for the whole family to watch. Well, I don't know about the whole family. You know, it does have some gore in it. That might not be good for uh, smaller children. But other than that, the movie had a good pace to it. You know, Megan Fox, you know, she's really not a great actress to me. But if she makes movies like this, this would put her back on the map because I know it got a good rating. You know, Rotten Tomato gave it, I believe they gave it like an 88%. You know, and I I could take that because it was a well done, it was a well done horror thriller. That's why I call this movie a horror thriller. You know, you're gonna see surprises all through this movie. I'm telling you, all through this movie, you will see surprises. So this is definitely a movie for you to watch. You know, I wouldn't tell you to watch it if it wasn't that good. You know, this is definitely a movie for horror and thriller fans to watch. It was well, well done. This is the Melster and this is my review of the well done horror thriller Till Death starring Megan Fox. Check it out. I feel like I'm being watched anti-Melster. Do you got anything to do with that? No, Melster. Why would I do anything like that? You're my pal. Why would I try and do that to you? I love to see the Melster frustrated. Until next time.